Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, I'm Paul from AUO. Um, it's my uh, great honor to be here to uh, share with you what I know about display, the technologies, uh, present and future. History is the best way to learn about the past, which also shapes the present and even the future. So to begin with, I will go a little bit into the Chinese history to show you how the evolution of the display technologies can take history as a mirror. Over the past uh, several thousand years, China experienced various uh, uh, territorial change under different dynasty. When a territory was large and rounded in shape, it was uh, generally a time with a greater imperial power. The power would be demonstrated by the empire's impressive economic, medical, and te technological development. However, a territory was divided into smaller states. The different states were generally more dynamic, but also weaker in power. A large state may be more powerful, but it was not always a winner. On the contrary, a smaller state could also live well if it found its way of survival. Romans of the Three Kingdoms is one of the four great classic novels in China. A classic quote goes, the empire long divide must unite. Long unite must divide. In the competition, the rise and fall of a state was influenced by both internal and external factors. The former were more subjective in nature, such as the governance. The later were more objective such as uh, the environment or natural disasters. Come to think of it, the evolution of display technologies also fit this discussion. Display evolution starts from the CRT technologies uh, applied in black and white TV in the early 20th century. In the, in the 90s, we had seen the rise of all sorts of the flat panel display technologies, include PDP, FED, TFT, LCD, OLED, and e-paper. It is a fitting to describe it as the first warring state period for flat panel display technologies. Eventually, TFT, LCD became the dominant display technology over the past two decades. It has been widely used for applications from notebook PC to cell phone, desktop PC, TV, and PID. On the other hand, CRT, FED, and PDP gradually became history due to their technical and application barriers. So today, my agenda, we will start from the user's perspective towards the display. In the IoT world, displays are everywhere. Displays help to carry all sorts of information and are used differently in various types of location and settings. In addition to display for personal and residential use, display also have been introduced to public spaces transportation, and smart factories. At this year's CES, the most popular topics center on applications for TV, VR, and gaming. These applications have one thing in common. That is, they all demand a highly immersive and lifelike viewing experience. This uh, will be realized by high resolution, HDR, and high refresh rate. 4K resolution has a must have when consumers replace their TV. Next, TV makers are working to develop even higher 8K resolution. 
Netflix has launched high dynamic range video service, which helped to speed up uh, penetration rate in TV. HDR is also extending to smartphone. Major smartphone brands are introducing the features to premium models this year. Motion blur free, the high refresh rate, gaming sense can be shown smoothly with no lag at all. People need a display to function under all sorts of circumstances. For outdoor display, it is important for them to withstand weather conditions and operate with a high brightness or under light, a high temperature for a long period of time. Wide temperature operate, operation is a must for automotive application. For mobile applications, the display to be readable under the sunlight. They also need to be power saving at the same time. Quality displays need to satisfy the life cycle of different requirements to avoid uh, premature uh, replacement. This applies to a smartphone with a shorter lifetime, probably two to three years, or a car with uh, over 10 years of lifetime. Climate change isn't just a threat to polar bear or the Arctic, it also has a profound impact on people. The Paris Agreement aimed to keep a global temperature rise below two degrees Celsius within this century and hopefully to control the rise to within 1.5 degrees Celsius. How can we make this place more eco-friendly? It would require more power and can be saved when the device is being used. Manufacturing process can be modified to reduce the impact to the environment. Parts of the uh, devices can be recycled at the end of the life. So, this is our belief. TFT LCD will continue to maintain the leading edge. LCD provides true to life color performance. By enhancing the color saturation, LCD can bring images colors to reality. As soon as the quantum dot film is used in the display bed light with an optimized color filter, LCDs can attain a much higher color saturation of NTSC 110%. This brings more accurate and vivid color performance. In general, people do not watch a displaced in a total darkness unless they are in a cinema. When audience watch a displays in ambient environment, the reflection of light on the screens will reduce the image quality. High contrast ratio is a key feature of a PSA or CD technology. Compared with IPS LCD or OLED, PSA LCD is able to provide superior image quality under ambient environment. LCD can deliver outstanding picture quality from high dynamic range technology even in ambient environment. In high ambient light environment, displays are required to present more picture details 
and what the human eyes can see in the real world. Therefore, it is important to overcome the influence of ambient light. LCD can provide low, lower ambient light refraction and higher brightness to make images more vivid in the bright environment. Underneath was the uh, shootout event by uh, UK TV. According to the rating result uh, for premium HDR TV, PSA LCD with the lower light refraction and high ambient contrast outshine other displays. LCD is a uh, high competitive in premium TVs. Here in terms of the picture quality, currently the super large uh, size LCDs in mass production are over 85 inches. The peak brightness and ambient contrast ratio, it would be a double up of uh, OLED. The color gamut can reach as uh, 110% with the quantum dot. And image burning is uh, less of an issue in uh, LCD. Furthermore, the light component and the liquid crystal of uh, LCD have much longer lifetime than organic emitting materials used for OLED. Here is a look back at uh, TV trends for CS, we can see that the technological innovations of LCD advance continuously and enable brands to introduce new product features every one to two years. New features of LCD TV include immersive picture quality, such as a high resolution, white color gamut, and high dynamic range, as well as a stylish appearance and energy saving. These physical features can add values to product and brands. LCD not only brings new values to brands, but also benefit to consumers. Taking the Black Friday sales in North America as an Example, consumers uh, pay $999 for a 42-inch HDTV in 2006. And then 10 years later, for a similar price, consumers could purchase a 65-inch LCD TV with a large size, UHD 4K, higher resolution, better picture quality, and more stylish appearance include slim bezel and curved design at only $10.99. In the meantime, it would cost more than double the price to purchase a 65-inch OLED TV, but without all the advanced features above. LCDs for automotive applications are becoming more common. Center informative display and digital instrument clusters have gradually become standard equipment in recent years. In addition, head-up display and real seat entertainment are preferred optional equipment or the top priority on modification. Because of the severe automotive environment, LCDs for automotive need to pass harsh testing conditions. It takes long time accumulation of technological capabilities and experience to obtain approval from automotive manufacturers, which cannot be achieved in a short span of time. Automotive displays require high brightness should be more than 1,000 nits. Why operating temperature from minus 30 to plus 100 Celsius, and long lifetime, 50,000 uh, hours. 
LCD. <laughs> I, I hope it's uh, 50,000 years, okay. <laughs> LCD technology is already capable of meeting the high standard requirements for reliability. LCD for automotive applications will further grow in the future. Mirrorless car is a reflection of a automotive, automotive for future. Mirrorless system can help in improving fuel efficiency and enhancing driving safety. Automakers are stepping up efforts to use cameras and LCD screens in place of a side view and a rear view mirror. Fast response uh, LCD can meet the criteria with uh, new liquid crystal materials and new panel driving mode. By using liquid crystal dimming technology, LCD can deliver better anti-glare function than the electric anti-glare rear view mirror. Car buyers nowadays demand stylish interiors with uh, modern features. LCD can provide curved service design with a curvature from uh, 1,000 radius to less than 100 radius, and can turn any curved service in a car interior into an active display. LCD structure enable high degree of freedom by combining various uh, components to achieve different features and satisfy diverse applications. Sunlight readable and power saving using reflective liquid crystal and memory in pixel in array technology. Touch and display integration reduce the thinness of LCD panel for slim design or more space of battery. Motion blur free improve response time with the new liquid crystal materials and new driving mode designed to enhance the gaming performance for players. High brightness enhance the effectiveness of outdoor and indoor advertisement. In order to provide consumers with a better visual experience, LCD technologies never stop innovation. In terms of the image quality, currently quantum dots are used in LCD backlights to provide a wide color gamut. For the next step, quantum dots will be incorporated into color filter for true to life color performance. Using bed light local dimming to achieve the high contrast ratio has reached a mature stage. In the future, dual cell for pixel dimming technology can be applied to increase the contrast ratio to the level of one medium to one. LCD technologies have a great potential to generate new applications and create new business opportunities. By using color filter free and polarizer free technology, the transmittance can be enhanced to over 70%. In addition, when applying AR technology on windshield, it can deliver more information for drivers. Transparent LCD can also be incorporate into interior design or use as uh, shop windows. The adjustable light transmittance of uh, liquid can be used to control the transmittance of sunlight to replace the traditional sunroof of cars. With the unique characteristics of liquid crystal and spatial array circuit design, LCD technology can be applied for high-frequency wireless antenna in replacement of a traditional car antenna. It will be used for an internet of vehicles in a 5G era. 
Then, beyond TFT LCD, what other display technologies? Okay. OLED owns a self-emissive uh, structure without spell lights, therefore it's uh, thin and light. When adopting OLED, the encapsulation glass and array substrate can be replaced by polyimide material. It can make the display even thinner and bendable with a fixed curvature. More issues uh, need to be studied and solved for OLED to be made freely bendable and affordable, such as uh, new materials and technologies for flexible manufacturing process, year improvement, cost reduction. Second, supply chain collaborations include battery, print, circuit board, and IC innovations. Third, appropriate business model and price strategy to make the end products more affordable for consumers. So, when will this affordable come out? OLED is uh, self-emissive uh, and consumes low power under black uh, background. It is uh, suitable for smartwatch applications, which uh, simply use uh, displays to show information as, uh, such as uh, time, weather, heartbeat, and email subject. OLED can perfectly present black, a uh, pure black. Integrated with the special frame design, it is especially fit for luxury and classic styles watches, showing elegant fashion. So circle design watch is the mainstream in current watch market, with a unique circuit design to reduce the space of light, the watch becomes even more delicate. Classical watches need slim bezel design to offer a trendy look suitable for various uh, occasion. AUO is not only the world's uh, first uh, supplier to provide true circle OLED panels, but also the first choice of watch brands when they introduce a brand new smartwatch product. Next, uh, Micro-LED. Micro-LED has the characteristic of a white color gamut, high brightness, fast response, curve, and low power consumption. However, Micro-LED is not yet a mature technology for mass production. During manufacturing, bottlenecks still need to be overcome, include mass transfer, fast inspection, and further cost structure improvement. To achieve a successful micro-LED mass production, multi-sector cooperation and continuous investment are needed between the industry of LED, TFT LCD, and precision machinery. In the short term, micro-LED technology may more likely to be applied to large size signage and wearable products. In the long term, it may be possible to be applied on automotive applications. <coughs> this, um, this chart uh, shows the global capacity investment on LCD and OLED are still growing. Until 2023, LCD capacity will still tax over 90% of the uh, flat panel display capacity area share. As I mentioned earlier, so far most applications requirements can be satisfied by LCD technology. So LCD will continue to innovate and maintain its dominance position in the next few years or even the decade. 
LCD is leading in the green manufacturing. From this chart, the uh, OLED uh, water consumption and the power consumption is much higher than LCD. Water is uh, 1.3 times and power is uh, almost a uh, double. Then while LCD process, while OLED the process changed from rigid to flexible, the consumption of water and the uh, power increased further as uh, extra critical equipment are needed. The waste water from the LCD process can be recycled after a prepared uh, treatment, but it is uh, hard for OLED to do so due to metal ions on waste water. It is tough to do further treatment. This will possibly pose a burden to the environment for pollution when the scale of uh, OLED production goes up. LCD has a uh, longer lifetime uh, on the chart. You can compare. Uh, it is able to avoid unnecessary poor head uh, replacement. And it is more friendly to the environment with a lower replacement frequency. The structure of LCD can be divided into display panel and bedlight module. When the product reaches its end of the life, it is possible to partially replace the bedlight module instead of scrapping directly. So now come to the conclusion of today's sharing. With our commitment for innovation and R&D, AUO has achieved numerous uh, technological breakthroughs. This graph illustrates AUO's uh, key strengths. With its leading core technologies uh, such as image quality, stylish design, and total solutions, by applying these uh, leading technologies, customer requirements for immersive viewing experience and hence service lives and great versatility can be satisfied. AUO will continue to enhance its operation efficiency. At the same time, we will engage ourselves in constant technological innovations and deepen our collaboration with strategic customers to fortify our long-term competitiveness and position in value-add product. Over the past decade, AUO has met outstanding achievements in water usage, power consumption, and carbon emissions reduction. So um, our water intensity is reduction up to 45% and 90% process water recovery rate, 40% energy use intensity reduction, 62% carbon emissions reduction, and we grant four buildings for uh, manufacturing fab for LEED certified. So let us uh, recall from the previous uh, pages. LCD, TFT LCD satisfies a high use visual experience requirements for the pre premium uh, TV market. For the automotive market, it also meets the demand for high reliability and durability. TFT LCD continues to make breakthrough, providing timely solution and affordable luxury performance for fast emerging display applications. In the worrying state era of display technology, TFT LCD will continue to evolve and sustain its continuing dominance and it will also continue to be more friendly choice for environment. OLED technology is, um, is uh, suitable for small and medium sized application, such as a mobile, VR, wearable devices. However, there is still high risk for display makers to make profit from OLED technology through general business operation model. New technology are trying to enter the market, but lots of the bottlenecks from the supply chain 
and manufacturing sites still need to be solved. Facing the next worrying stage, period of the tech display technologies, who will emerge as a winner in a new form of a competition? How will display technologies evolve? This is the answer. Survival of the fitness is the main principle in the Warren State area. Technologies last only when they find their right positions. If not, they will ultimately disappear. Thank you for your attention. I will end my presentation here. Thank you.